Hey everybody! I'm home for dinner and Eric and I decided to make raw sushi tonight which I found a recipe for online. I'll post the link underneath this video so you guys can see how the chef prepares it. All I had to buy was two avocados, a cucumber, a green pepper, a yellow pepper, green onions, mushrooms, and spinach. And then of course I bought this organic Pacific Sushi Nori. So these are the big sheets um, and 10 come in this pack. I got it at Whole Foods I think for like three or four dollars. Um, anyways, it was really the only option. So what I did was cut one of the big sheets that's this size in half lengthwise and followed the recipe which basically calls for cucumber and avocado mash as the like rice and sticky glue that holds the sushi together and then you just cut up the peppers and I added mushrooms and then green onions and cucumbers julienne and just put it in the sushi roll and roll it up so I just made my one of my last rolls this is the first time I've ever made sushi and it's actually really easy um, and really fun because I really like to dice vegetables so Anyways, I want to show you my last roll. I'm going to cut them up, and then I'm going to taste them for the first time. So I want everybody to join. So here are, and I don't have a sushi rolling mat. We used our placemat. That's like a bamboo placemat. And I really didn't even have to use it that much, and I really can't now for my last roll. But this is my last roll with the avocado mash and all my veggies piled on here. Cucumber, spinach, green onion, green pepper, and yellow pepper. And so I just kind of push it lightly together at the ends and start rolling it up. Kind of tight, but not really, because this seaweed, now that the avocado got on it, it feels like a wet paper towel, kind of, so I don't want to tear it. And I rolled it up, and I just set it over there. So lady on the video said, cut up the ones you made first, first, because... Now they've like solidified more and hardened. So this is my first roll. It was a little thicker than I anticipated, but full of veggies. The yellow peppers and the green peppers and the spinach sticking out. So you guys can see that and it's not too big. My roommate and I are both going to eat these. So we'll each probably get about like, I don't know, six to eight pieces of sushi. And I only paid $12 for all of these ingredients at Whole Foods, which is a feat in and of itself. So she just said kind of hold it tightly and cut right through. Of course the avocado is going to mush a little bit, but it's actually staying pretty intact. So then I'm just going to cut a second piece. She was right about the serrated knife. It's not a great idea. Let me grab a plate. Hold on. So I'm just going to put these on the plate. Ah, they're stuck together. I'll free you. Okay. Now they're apart. I was never much for food presentation because I was just ready to eat it once I saw it. But now my food is so beautiful. I want to enjoy it and make it pretty. So there it is. The avocado pepper, green onion, cucumber, sushi. I hope that you guys like the recipe and you try it. Let me know if you like it. Bye.